mates. I miss my friends. See, already that's the wrong word. We call each other mates. It's a term my mum hates. All right, mate. How you doing, mate? What are you wearing, mate? It's our chosen word. Not to copulate, but simply a term of endearment for the troops. From when we were youths and drank in groups round tables and pubs in pursuit of hijinks, shenanigans. Drinks at parties, not happenings. Or gigs, or matches, or christenings. Where the complexities of rhythm slowly ebbed when we dared to dance. We'd been waiting on that tune. Fists bawled, smiles curled. Heels stomped by all the girls and the lads draped arms round shoulders slur something which resembles the words only slower. When I hold you, baby, feel your heart beat close to me. But sleep, drunken like winter, dark curtains drawn over that time. The sun's whiskey gold is bottled, conversation caught like wine. I think of your sofas, cats, dogs, kids. That lush marble breakfast bar which must have cost you a few quid and wish myself there, talking shit like we used to. We've sought substitutes, hills, walks in the rain for thrills but we know it's not the same. In some ways, it's better. We're here for double measures of each other's patter, the treasure of time together not spent on social media. Fuck, I miss your smell, mate. Aye, whatever. Promises wither. Pledges to see one another become as short-lived as graffiti, as desired as Excalibur. But it doesn't mean they are barren. This is a hunger, not a famine. Drop me a line before time drags us too late and we'll speak soon. For now, take care mate.